the... Okay, Frankie, I'm out here. Yes. I want to film here. Okay, but let's go over the criteria of all of these knives. We have to eliminate knives. Yes. All right, guys. It's now or never. We're going to do this video. This is the best knife, according to us. Us, yes. Of 2019. 2019, and they had to have appeared on the channel. Yeah, so if it didn't appear on our channel, it could be the best knife in the world. If we didn't have access to it, then we don't know. Then it's not included in this collection. Right. And it's got to be a 2019 release. Ooh, yes. Tricky, tricky. Yeah, so let's... Um, Start this is, getting rid of some? This table here, you can you can pause it at some point if you want to now, because we're going to start taking knives away. This is the best of the best that we picked. Yes. From 2019. So if they're on this table, we love them. True. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's okay. start getting rid of knives. Okay, what are you going to get rid of? Well, let's start off with... Uh, okay, something easy. The Honey Badger, you guys know we love them. Yes. We put this out here for a couple of reasons. One, they made this is D2, so that's cool. That was new. Right, that was new for this year. We don't have the Warncliffe. Yeah. That's super awesome, and it's a 2019 release, but yeah. We're just going to say it's kind of the same as the previous model. So. Sure, okay. All right, Frankie, what you got? Okay, I'm going to get rid of, oh, what one was, I had it in my mind of which one I was going to get rid of first, but now I forgot. I'm going to get rid of this one. This is the Boker Kihon. Kaihan. Kaihan. Kihon, yeah. It's very similar to any of the Kalashnikovs, so I'm just going to get rid of it. It's a different version of a Kinda popular knife. Similar. Yeah, it's very cool. It is cool. I love it. Yeah. It's very inexpensive. So, but, yeah. I'm getting rid of him. Okay, it goes. It goes. All right, Frankie, we were talking about Mini and XL knives. Right, we were, yes. Okay, there was some fantastic releases. Yes. I'm thinking way back there. The XL Sheepdog. This is a great knife. It's based off a platform that we love. Right. But it's been out since 2016. Exactly. So we're just going to get rid of him. It's a cool knife, but show. it's XL. It's awesome. You yeah. could use this as EDC and a kitchen knife when you get home. <laughs> that is true, yes. It's, it's sweet. See our videos. By the way, see our videos on any of these knives. Any of these knives. Yeah, they're all good. Okay, that being said, I'm going to get rid of the mini Doman. I think the Doman was a 2018 release. Yes, but the mini version came out with the mini Big Lighter. And both of those ones came out this year. Take your pick. They're both very similar knives. Here, show yeah. that one too. Yeah. Both platforms are awesome. We recommend them. Yeah, they're sweet little knives. Go ahead, you can take them. The mini version. Yes, XL hands can still use it. I prefer the mini big lighter better than the Doman. Okay. So I'm going to keep right. him. We're going to constantly the tighten side. the shot here. Yes, get these yeah. in tighter. Well, I got to say the subvert back there. Yeah. Put that inside somewhere because that's not going away. It's not going away anytime no. soon. No, Spyderco had a few really good releases. We could get rid of this one. What you got? The Gerber Fastball. I put it out there because it's a Gerber, and it's like, yay, you guys did something. But we're going to also get rid of it because it's a Gerber. <laughs> so mean to say. It's terrible. I know. Good for them, though. It was okay. It's, it it's, was, it's better than they've done in the past. I don't know so, why I don't care about it as much. Yeah, just, it just reminds me of a Kershaw. Well, I see one over there in the top right corner. Top right? No. This? Yeah. Okay. All right, this is the Civivi Rustic Gent. It's a backlock. It's a traditional. That's why we put it out there because the it, it's a traditional that we both kind of like. Well, traditionally we don't like traditionals. Right, and this one kind of changed that. It is cool. Yeah. See our, I guess, non-existent video. We haven't done a full video on it. Well, yet. they've not been available because no, they're, they they're selling out. Yeah. All right, we do like it, but we're gonna get rid of it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna get rid of him. All right. What else are we getting rid of? Oh, this is probably gonna make people hate me really fast. Why? Because I'm going to get rid of this Minion Natrix. The Natrix? Yes. Oh, it was a copper Natrix, but yes. the Natrix came out before that. It came right. out in 2018. But everybody went gaga over this thing, and they I went, still don't like it. They went Lady Gaga over this? Yeah, they did. I don't like it. The Natrix is a cool design. It, It is for some people. I just don't like it. Yeah. All right. We heard that one on Blade HQ as well. It yeah. did sell pretty well. Uh, speaking of Blade HQ. Yes. You guys are looking at this knife here. Okay, the bug out. My most carried knife, really, for the last two years. Um, it's a 2017 release. This is the blackout bug out. It came out in 2019. That's true. So it it's kind of like, uh, yeah, it, it doesn't really count. I put this on the table for well that reason, and Blade HQ said this was their number one selling knife. Well, we know that people loved it too. So yeah, yeah, okay. Like us. 
So where are we I at I went tighter. Here? I went tighter. Yeah. Where are we at? Um, let's see here. When you can get rid of Frankie. I can get rid of this one. <laughs> no. It's so big. I just don't. See our video on this? Yeah, it, it is huge. This is the Best Tech Fanga. Frankie, this is the Best Tech Fanga. Yeah. Um, I, I want to say it's a little under $100 or it's 80 or something like that. See our video on it. It's awesome. It's really cool. It's a giant clip point knife. It is. It's absolutely huge. And the action is beautiful. It no, is. keep it on the table. Keep it on the table? For now. Jeez. Okay, fine. For now. Okay, so what This is the CJRB. Now, uh, uh, this was probably our mutual favorite from the four that we have. Yeah. Frankie, this is the Agro Crag. Agro Crag. It's just the Crag, though. Crag, yeah. Yeah, this one, I want to say they're less than... I right want to say like 35 bucks. Yeah, I want to say less than 50 yeah. $40, something like that. Yeah. Uh, pretty cool knife. My mom <laughs> thought this knife cost $850. That is still really funny. See that video. Yeah. But, but yeah. it is a good budget knife for sure. Honorable so. mention there. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Let's see. Oh, you know what we can get rid of? What? The Spyderco Indela. Yes. 2019 release. Great knife. It's based off the platform of the Delica and the Endura. It's right in between. It's when they have a baby, this is what you get. No, it's like the middle school age. No, this it's is... the size of a, if you combine it's, okay. an Indela and Endela. Endura and a Delica. See our video on that. We'll have that discussion there. But it's, <laughs> uh, you know, it's kind of an old, it's kind of old news. Yeah. Even though it's awesome. And if you have one, you know. Yeah, exactly. It's kind of one of those knives that you just have to have anyways if you have a Delica. Well, it's, it may be the perfect fit for you, and if you can handle them in person, um, yeah. Yes. Okay, what else we got, Frankie? Here, I'll get rid of him. He's really cute. It's a Steel Wheel Kobold. Steel Wheel's done some really cool stuff this year. Yeah. I like where they're going with a lot of their designs. Yeah. And I like the two color combos, and I just like them. They're just good knives. Kobold, yeah. That's but, probably I mean, too small D2. for you. And you guys know me. I'm not a huge fan of D2. So D2's not going to win this year? I know. It was this whole... 2019 was the year of D2. Like it always okay. is. But whatever. Right. I'm going to get rid of him. Okay. Well, if we're talking mini knives, you kept the... Mini bag lighter? Yeah, bag I did. lighter on the table. I did. I think we should get rid of them because it's a, it's, it's oh, a okay. mini version of an existing knife. That's true. Okay. I do really like the color that they came out with. I like yeah, this yeah. denim blue. It's really sweet. No, that can go. Okay. okay. Even though I, it's awesome. Yeah, it is awesome. But does it count? The mini booze. Mini the booze. booze smoke. Kind of the same thing. It's a late 2017, I want to say. Yes. But then the mini version came out 2019. I just horribly uh, demonstrated that, yeah. but yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'll do it for you. Somebody, somebody said that uh, they couldn't stand watching us open front flippers. Yeah. yeah. Hey, guys, try it. If you go back No, this guy was an all... expert. Okay. Oh, he was an expert? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. What else Whatever. do we have? Um, part of the launch series in with uh, Kershaw. Yes. This was pretty awesome, but it's not really an EDC knife. It's just cool. You like your stilettos. So and it was have. well done. These are all around $100, the launch series. Mm -hmm. You get powdered steel with it, USA made. It's it pretty cool. cool. Yeah. It's pretty cool. But it's not really an EDC knife for me. Mm -hmm. Here you go. I'm just handing them all to you. I, know, okay. I put a box over here, but it's empty. Yeah, that's All right, fair. what do we have? Okay, this is kind of a gray area also. So it's the Z Brad Zinker Mass Drop Collabo. Killer the, Collabo. Yes, it's the frame lock. No, sorry, the liner lock version. Of the dog tooth. Of the dog tooth. I love these knives. Absolutely love them. Probably one of my favorites from Mass Drop. But then the other model came out last year, so... Yeah. It's kind of a gray we can, area. We can get rid of it yes. because of that gray area. Exactly. Yeah, that's it's an lighter. awesome, awesome knife. Yeah, if you I have one. some are still available. If you have one, you know. Yeah. All right. What are we doing here, Frankie? What are we doing? What do you want to get rid of next? There's some really good stuff here. If, okay, I can probably get rid of the Laconico, is it the Keen? Keen? Yeah, speaking of Mass Drop, it's an excellent knife, but we have one that we like more. Yes. Of Laconico's designs. True, yes. So, the, yeah, that's a nice little gray area also. Nice little gray area. Mm -hmm. Frank is just looking for easy. I know, easy ways to get, uh, because it's hard to get rid of any of these knives. It yeah. really is. Well, Spider Co. Yeah. This is the lightweight Pair 3. Yes. Pair 3's been out for a couple, a two or years, three years yeah. now. Yeah. Well, and let's just say this is an honorable mention because it's on everybody's top list for 2019. Is it? It really is. It's a great knife, really great knife in but that mid-budget range. 
but it's gray area because it, it, it's ex- exactly it's existed already. If it's I already talk. existed, so yeah. that's where we're getting we're getting a little bit pickier that way. New designs, new okay. new. Well, Only if we're talking new, new, shoot, it's getting hard. It is getting harder. And that's not funny at all. I, I, it really is not. No. All right, let's take a break here. I, I, all right. Okay, let's get rid of. We can do this one. We're at we're at ten minutes, and we still have a lot of talking to do. Uh, yeah, we do. Frankie. Yeah. There it is. The Wee Knives Blokow. Blokow! This thing's pretty awesome. It really is. It's it's bigger than a knife that I carry lately. Exactly. Um, That's why we can we can get it rid of it. When you when you mess with it a couple times you really can get the hang of it, but it's not an EDC knife for me lately. No, it's not. Okay, fine. Okay. Alright, now let's take a break. Okay, let's take a break now. Okay, four hours later, the table is the same. <laughs> Break's over. No, we just took a little coffee break. Okay, Frankie, we need to eliminate some more knives. We need to tighten this up some more, right? One that I hate to get rid of, but I can. This is yeah. the Knight's Edge Templar. Mm -hmm. I love it. It is really cool. But this is a prototype, and nothing has happened with it yet. Nothing's come from it so quite yet. I, I think we can get rid of it. Get rid of him? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what else? Um, let's see here. More, yeah. Okay, so there's a... No, that that's sand on the table. Okay. That's the subvert. Okay. Okay, the Jumbones. Jumbones. Also love it, but it's a XL version of an existing XL, knife. XL, yes. Exactly. So it's not anything super new. See the Crossbones video? That thing is so huge. Every time I handle it, I'm like, oh my god, that is really big. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We can get rid of that, though. Okay. Love it. Yes. Love all the ones that were on the table. Okay, any others? Keeping the finger. Let's, Let's see, see what else we got. I could get rid of the Yorkie. I wouldn't. Okay, fine. Love that knife. Okay, well, put that back. What about the finger? Can you get rid of him? Not yet. Not yet? Okay. I could, I, okay, Microtech, this is the coolest thing they did for 2019. This is the Dirac, and then they've got the Dirac Delta, the XL. Yeah, the vi big one. The only reason, I mean, it's super cool with the front face. Yeah. The only reason I can get rid of it is just double edge. It's not super practical. It's stabby, but it's just not, it's not EDCable as much. Okay, and then you have to mo be careful of what state you travel with. Not everybody can have them. Right? Yeah. So, what else we got? Should we get, we could get rid of the little chunky one. Love that knife. Another 2019 Microtech. Yes, and now they have all different colors. You're color. scratching it with no, your I'm rings. Not. You're just scratching it with your rings. I am not. Sounded like it. Jeez. I'm not. Okay, the Exo set. Super cool. Now you can get them with colors. Yes. That's the reason why I'm going to get rid of this one, is because I would rather it be in a color. <laughs> okay, but it's super cool. It is really cool. If it made it this far, guys, yeah. It means it is a good knife for sure. All right. Well, what are we looking at here? This is probably staying. Yeah, this Frankie the Damned in. Designs Oni. Oni. Nice. What was that? A full reach around. Jeez. Okay. Yeah, yeah that, that's, he likes it. that's probably staying. Okay. Um, I don't know. Savivi knives? Okay. The Elementum? That's staying. That one's staying. Let's so we get, could get rid of this one. Any Savivi knives, they're all good. Right, or yeah. most of them are good. This is the Wyvern. It's pronounced Wyvern. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um, Dragon Scales. It's cool. It's it is. maybe, because of the Dragon Scales, maybe it's a little cheap because of the G10, or this is actually no, like a... Well, it's, it's a budget version of the Dragon. Right. So, I this mean... This is a budget version of a very expensive knife. Yes. I don't know, we'll get rid of it. Okay, we'll get rid of it. Okay, what else we got? Oh, how many of you got these? I this love is that knife. The, this is the Fair and Forge Protec Mass Drop Mordax <laughs> Button Lock. Yes. Made by Wii. No, no. I'm just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> Maybe. No, it's not. This thing's awesome. Uh, shoot. It's made by Protec. Don't make people think that. The Duras? It's pretty cool. It can slice a bottle in half. Yeah, what do you think? Um, I like it a lot. But, I mean, I call him my chunky turd, so... Why would you say that on video? Anyway. That's what it is! Look at it! We haven't talked about this knife here. Well, but what are here, we doing with it? Is it I'll stained? get rid of it just because, I mean, brown's not my favorite color. So, we'll just get rid of it that way. A 2019 Medford. We we thought about it, but the Smooth Criminal was officially right. released in 2018. But Der Otherwise, Hund. it would be here. Der Hund. Pretty sweet. It's and an awesome little knife. It's got my edge on there. Yes. There we go. There it is. Yeah. Um, that's a pretty sweet knife. It is pretty sweet. It's very expensive. 
that's true. For what it is, but that's, you gotta pay to play. That's what I was gonna say, oh Frankie. Oh my goodness, you're stupid. Okay. Am well, I keeping it, or am I getting rid of it? I don't know. Okay, let's get Of spider cones, the Aikuchi. Yeah, amazing. <laughs> amazing, <laughs> there we go. Jeez. Um, super cool, love it. Probably slightly less EDCable to me, but I love it. I'm keeping it on the table, I'm just saying. I'm going I'm to. I'm not just because this one was the first run and it had that. Well, that and they that. fixed it, so it's fine. Okay, all right, keep it on the table. What about the BRS Nomad? Nomad, this is super cool. That's probably my favorite thing from BRS. Yeah. This year, that Tanto is just so aggressive. For me, the handle's a bit thick. Yeah. I wish it was like a scaled down version of this. Okay. All right, it can go. It okay. made it this far. It's pretty cool, yeah, though. It makes it, it makes it pretty far. All right, the CRKT CEO. Yeah. Let's grab that. Love this knife. I'm going to get rid of it because I wish I had the Blade HQ version. <laughs> oh, that's true, the yeah. The D2 version. That one made it far in a lot of people's videos. I like where CRKT is going with the knives this year. They do a lot of cool designs. They really do. We'll get rid of this one just because of... It's 8 HCR? Are we blaming 8 HCR? I don't know. I don't know. In a lot of videos, we say it's a good steal. It's a good steal, but I mean, I don't know. It's okay. We have to get rid of stuff for some reason. Right. Kaiser Microlith, that's staying. Shoot, what are we going to get rid of? Okay. The Ganzo? The Ganzo's staying. This is the Rhino, is it the FH? 61. Six, 61? Yeah. Really, they came out with a lot of good knives this year, but... That one is just, I like the blue that they used this year. And it's I just, so well just, done. I really like him. I can't, I can't get rid of it. I can't get rid of you. Yeah, all right. What okay. are we getting rid of? Not the Liang Ma Cuff. Oh. That sound. <laughs> that sound is so good. All right, what are we doing, Frankie? Okay, what about the subvert? Can you get rid of him yet? I will, just because it's too big of a knife for me. Yeah, not what she said. It's it's huge. It's like a it's awesome. Baton I love it. for me. I love it. Shh. Careful. Jeez. All right, get rid of it. It's too okay. big for that reason. Frankie the Fanga. It's awesome. It's just I don't I don't carry knives this big anymore. Not really. Used to. This is such a bird. Look at him. It's a cool knife. Look at him. It's like the perfect bird profile. Okay, see our video for that. I'm yeah. just saying. Yeah. Every time I see him, I love him. All right, him. the smock. Probably my yeah. favorite Spider Co. from 2019. It's a pretty sweet knife. Are they even available? I don't well, know. See our video. We've yeah, got I'm links sure. and all that stuff. Well, what we're going to bring it down to five. Five each. Five each. I claim this one. So. Let's just grab our five from here now. That claim would be a one. Wait, claim... no, you can't. Yes, I can. Not all at once. You can't claim all, right, all at once. Go ahead. Then I get to claim one go here ahead. and then you. And be then... quicker. I'm going to take Angry Baby Bear. Okay, yeah. The Alliance designs go pretty far. I don't love they? this knife. Look at this thing. Speaking of Laconico designs. He is just, overall, this is one of my perfect size knives right now. It's just my favorite favorite overall okay carbon fiber there. everything okay see our video on that okay all right well for that reason i'm going to keep the alliance designs easy e also laconico design yeah you carried that one a ton last year yeah i love it all right we're gonna go yeah blade out safety first blade out let's try and tighten them up okay all right what you got what's your next pick what's my next pick yeah i'm going with the coochie okay I love the Akuchi. I love the Kuchiku. sleek Akuchi Q trailing Who's the point. Um, isn't Alexander? it Alexander? Yeah. Yeah, uh, just a sweet knife. Yeah, really. he's just cool. And I like the story behind it too, so I like it when there's stories too. Well, if we're going Spider Co. Actually, <laughs> stories. Angry Baby Bear is a story also, so that's what's cool. We'll too. see our video on that. Yeah, okay. Yeah. The smock. I have to choose the smock. Yeah, of course you do. It's awesome. It is awesome. Okay, what do we choose? Um. Do I get to pick it, or do you get to pick it? Our favorites. Elementum. All right, well, somebody has to. Right. Civivi Elementum. It is a great budget knife. Everything about it is awesome. Yeah. Colors, everything. Get one if you can. Did we mention the Steel Wheel Chatbot yet? No, we have not. I'll choose it. You're going to choose it? This is probably it? my favorite Steel Wheel from 2019. It's just really cool, and it's cheap. It is. It's affordable. It's affordable, okay. D2 even. I know. It's coated D2. I don't know. The lightweight feel versus the detent, it's uh, it's great. Okay, you only have one more. I get two more. Uh, all right, go ahead. Um, of the... Hmm. I'm going to have to fast forward. This. I know, I know. This is where it gets really difficult, okay? okay. It gets difficult. 
Um, it's one of your knives, but I'm going to take it because I want it because of the sound. The cuff, yes. Liang Ma, one of our favorite designers. I absolutely love the style of this okay. knife. I love Liang Ma, everything about this. I like all of the different ways you can deploy it. All right, bring them in. Like, listen to that sound. Oh, so amazing. Okay, I only get one more. Yeah, you get one more. I have to choose. Yeah, they're all so good. They're all so good at this point. Okay, let's just label them real quick. This is the Kaiser Yorkie. This is the Dam Design Oni. Medford Derhund. Kaiser Microlith, and then the Ganzo FH61. I'm going to go with the Microlith. Really? Nick Swan design. It's too small for me, I guess, but mm, it's awesome. I love it. I love it. And there's another version that we have, too, but we only got this one out. This is our favorite, and it's super, super, super light. Uh, yeah, Microlith. Okay. Probably my favorite Kaiser. This might shock you guys. Of the year. But I have to give it to the Ganzo Marino. I'm just the renaming Ganzo it. Ganzo Rhino? It sounded like you said okay. Rhino. The Ganzo Rhino. Right. I just really love the Rhino horn of the blade. And it's just really cool. I that was our favorite. I bonded with him up on the roof when mm -hmm. we did our... our um, what, did we use that one? Yes, I used this up we did on some, the roof. Yeah, we did some roof repair this summer. And I got this thing coated in roof stuff and... Tar. Tar. And I just really, really like him. I bonded with him. And yes, I know it's D2, right. and I need to eat my words. No, it's when it like comes $25. That. It's less than that. $25. It's an awesome little S knife. See our videos. Yeah, FH61. Okay, I set so that really one down. I really like it. Okay. That means we have to get rid of these. Yes. Go ahead. Super awesome, super awesome, super awesome. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we've brought it down to this. Frankie, pick your favorite. Pick my favorite. Your one favorite. One favorite. Yep. I guess you guys probably aren't really surprised by this, but I just really like my Angry Baby Bear. If you've been watching the channel all year. Yeah. yeah. Mechanico Design, Alliance Designs, it's just kind of overall just amazing. Everything that I like in a knife is right here. It's been a perfect combination. It really is. The problem is, I want to pick my Laconico Design, Alliance Designs knife as well. Yes. We really like where Alliance Designs has gone this year. Or last year. Gosh, it's between. I don't know. These are all so good. I think it's those two. Here, let's. Yeah. These two? Yeah. Our picks. Wow. Number okay. One. What do you guys think? I think, actually, we completely forgot one for this year. Did we? Yes, we did. All right, go ahead with Dude. The absolute best, best knife of 2019 is. I'm very partial. Oh. Of course. <laughs> of course, it's my knife. It has to be the best knife of 2019. I Come think, on. I think there's some still available. Did you guys get one? This is the Frankie and Bird Classic. This is Frankie's art. Yes. Yeah, these things are awesome. We it's both carry the, them every day. It's the best knife of 2019. Shoot. That's probably, since we've had them, that's probably been the most carried. Yes, it really has been. <laughs> Officially. Okay, well, that's what we got, guys. Well, let's talk about how amazing this knife is. In that video, you can so see that. It has a little. In know, that video, they can see that. We got to wrap this up. Okay, okay. The video's but like look over at 20 it. minutes. It's absolutely. It's everything that you need in a knife, you guys. You need to all have one. Keychain. Even has scissors. I Key use these scissors all the time. Okay. Look what at What do you guys think? This of what we've shown, <laughs> our two favorites happen to be Alliance Designs. Look, it has an award. There we go. Yeah. All right. It's perfect. We'll do that. But our two favorites happen to be Alliance Designs and Laconico. Yeah. Real quick, um, Sharp by Design, The Void. Yes. Probably would have made the table. There's a void here. But there's a the void, void for it, yeah. Yes. Um, the Summit Knife Half Dome, that might have made the table. Um, True, yeah. But we never had, we never owned one. Yeah, we featured it. Yeah, so I think that's pretty much everything. Let us know if we forgot one. Mm -hmm. Let us know if there's one that we didn't discover. Oh, right. Frankie, Flashlight, Flash. Flashlight. Flashlight of the year? Best Flashlight of 2019. Which one is your favorite? I, I think it's a mutual favorite. No, it's not, actually. Go ahead. I believe this is your favorite. The Seeker 2. Seeker 2 Pro for tunnels? Yes. Oh, light? This one's my favorite. Oh, you've been using that one the most? Yeah, the Baton Pro. Okay. I All like right. the size of this. I have, actually, two of them in my car right, right. now. <laughs> well, they're not watching for flashlights. So. Okay, anyways. Okay, thanks a lot for joining us. 2020 knives are coming out now. Yes. You got grease on there or something? Oh, whatever. I use that knife. All right, anyway, look for lots of new content from our channel. Make sure you subscribe and hit that bell. Yeah, who knows what and 2020 is going to bring. Frankie. Thumbs up. Thumbs up, yeah. All yes. right, thanks a lot for joining us.